name's Chris Burdish. I'm a waterman, the stand-up paddleboard Guinness World 12-hour open ocean distance record holder and Mavericks Big Wave champion. I'm in the ocean on a regular basis and I've seen things go from good to bad very, very quickly. I've collaborated with the NSRI to bring you some SUP safety tips that are going to keep you safe and bring you in at the end of every day. Stand-up paddleboarding has been evolving now for the last sort of five to ten years. It's absolutely exploding worldwide and there are a whole lot of different channels that the sport can be broken down into. There's flat water paddling, there's wave riding, there's open ocean racing, um, open open adventuring. We're seeing so many water enthusiasts out on the ocean on a regular basis now. Um, a lot of people that don't have huge amounts of water and ocean knowledge. We've come up with five items that I'd like you to be mindful of in order to be able to come in in one piece and everybody to go home safely. And that is really to be safe, be warm, be bright, and communicate. For anyone who's supping recreationally, um, which means anything from 150 meters from the beach, please make sure that you are bright, wearing bright clothing, um, be warm, use a, a warm wetsuit top or a full wetsuit and a personal flotation device and use a leash at all times that connects you to your board so your board can never drift away from you. If you're thinking of going more than 150 meters offshore and especially if you're going to be paddling alone, please make sure that you wear a very colorful PFD flotation device which will give you an extra layer to keep you warm. Definitely a wetsuit. Ensure you're using the RSA Safe Tracks, which is that free app from the NSRI which will allow them to be able to monitor you, follow you, track you and find you if you do get yourself into trouble. If you're going to be paddling more than 250 meters offshore, either by yourself or with someone else, please make sure that you take some sort of hydration pack, wearing sunscreen, making sure you've got a whistle to be able to alert people, you've got a mirror to be able to reflect, to be able to draw attention to yourself, You've got either handheld flare or pencil flares. You've got some sort of nutrition that you can take with you as well. Make sure at all costs you've got your phone with you with that RSA Safe Tracks app downloaded so the NSRI can monitor you, and make sure that they can find you if you do get into trouble and everybody will know once you're back to shore in one piece. This is a great sport. We want you to enjoy it. Have fun out there, but be bright, be warm, be safe. We want everybody to come back in one piece.